Hi everyone, welcome back to Barbie Dolls of the Week. This week we're going to focus actually on Ken doll, but quickly I want to show you this dress that I got recently. It's one of the few current fashions on the play line that I liked, so I did pick this up while it was on sale. Uh, I'm just curious, what, you, what do you guys think of this outfit? It's kind of nice, but I wish that uh, the back wasn't so plain but from the front I like it so I think that's a bit of an issue currently that they don't do a lot with the back of the clothes and it's just on this very temporary doll here so anyway just wanted to show you that and I don't think I showed you guys this this is that Oz doll the great and powerful Oz and he when I got him he had no clothes so I found him an outfit to wear that looks nice I thought with some old, very old Ken clothes, vintage Ken from the 60s. Unfortunately, I only had one shoe that fit him. So if anyone has a matching shoe, please let me know. For some reason, his feet must be a little different or differently shaped, bigger, something. But anyway, at least he's got clothes. He's got um, a lot of good flexibility, by the way. Okay, moving on to the focus. So what I want to do is show you 10 of my Ken dolls. I think it's 10. Somebody had asked if I could show some of my Ken dolls. I mean, I have quite a few that you're not going to see today, but let's focus on these, which are all the Superstar Error Ken dolls. Or not all of them, but some of them. And we're going to start with this one, which is, of course, Western Ken. Still got that nice crackling knees. Um, his hat stays on well. Um, he's got a little, you know, opening there, uh, but he's not real, real wobbly like some of them. So his outfit is in pretty good shape for as old as it is. Um, but yeah, I like this one. I've got another one up there on a horse, but, um, yeah, so this is Western Ken. Okay, let's set him aside. And then here's Hawaiian Ken. Um, which I believe was, I want to say that was 83, but don't, I'm not going to swear it. And unfortunately he's been sitting a lot uh, and I need to get him up actually. So his bathing suit is a little, uh, you know, gap, got a gap there. Uh, but here's his original outfit that he came with. He's got a very interesting look, as you see, very different. Hawaiian looking. He's got the abs of steel, as you see. So <laughs> it's okay. So that's him. I'm going to have a lap of Ken's here soon. Um, anyway, this is Fashion Jeans Ken, who, for some reason, on two of them I've seen, this always sticks up on this side. So i got to find a way, maybe put something underneath that to get that to stay down, some little double-sided tape or something. But, you know, it was very emblematic of the time in that, you know, you've got the designer type label and, you know, shirts down to here. My older brother, may he rest in peace, used to love to wear his shirts open down to here. Uh, even, re you know, in recent years before he passed away. So, yeah, this is Fashion Jeans Ken where he's back to being a blonde. Um, and I wasn't a fan of this where the shirt, I wish they would have had a second snap on it but other than that I really like this um, the belts a little out of whack but that's just from age but I love the jeans and he's got his boots on which you can't see their jeans are a little tight but these are boots okay so that's fashion jeans can and now we have a very similar looking can who is the roller skating can Unfortunately, I don't have the roller skates. I do have, I believe, one of these in the box. So, of course, he has his. But this one I gave some tennis shoes since he didn't have roller skates. Um, but one thing I like about this doll, I used to love the short shorts that men would wear back then um, in the 80s. Uh, not always this short. These are almost like Daisy Dukes for Ken. But... <laughs> um, just a short short. I mean, even basketball players wore them fairly short. Now they're wearing them, you know, down to here, and I hate that. Just it looks kind of ridiculous. But um, this is the, yeah, the roller skating can. Okay, now great shape can. Great shape can is back to being a brunette. And as you see here, he has this outfit that's, you know, very much for the workout. 
Um, he again just has the one snap, but at least the shirt goes up higher in the back, or the opening is less. Um, so he's got these shoes, which I believe are his original shoes. Uh, this one, the outfit is not very faded. I had one where the pants were very faded and I switched it out. I mean, I think this was the one, but I switched the pants out when I got another one. Now, this one's got a couple little issues, too, like the hem is, is missing or, or come out on this side where it's still there on this side. Um, but it looks pretty good. He's got some issues with the shirt around the armpits. Um, so, not perfect, but he's in pretty good shape for great shape. Can. Okay, moving on to Crystal Can. Crystal Can, and of course, the other thing I wanted to mention is that a lot of these dolls had the corresponding Barbie. I mean, Fashion Jeans did, and the roller skating, and of course, Great Shape. Uh, I'm not showing them today, but I've shown most of these before. And so did Crystal Can. Now, keep in mind, Crystal Can also had... Um, an African-American version of both the Barbie and the can, which is always nice. And one of his shoes just fell off. Now, that's something that you guys know I have a pet peeve about, is that a lot of these Barbie shoes from this time period won't stay on unless you put two-sided tape, which somebody gave me as a tip, and it works. But um, the Ken dolls, they usually stay on, and also the Ken dolls will usually stand on their own without a stand. In fact, if you see any up uh, here, and some are in the second shelf in the back especially, uh, like Rock or Derek, uh, they don't have a stand. They're just standing on their own. So that's always nice. Uh, but anyway, this is Crystal Can. He looks a lot like Great Shape Can uh, in the face. You know, similar. I wouldn't say identical, but similar. And I love, by the way, his Mr. Rourke style from Fantasy Island. Uh, white suit it's just I love it it's really nice and this one is of course not perfect after all these years so I want to show you the inside this iridescent vest I love it and the light like lavender tie plus he's got this little darker purple here so anyway that is crystal can I'll set him up there because my lap is indeed full um, and then we have Great Shape Can. Um, now, I believe I have two because one is in the daytime look and one's in the nighttime look. I don't recall if any of these had socks, by the way. I think so, but they don't currently, so not sure what happened there. But yeah, this is, um, did I say Great Shape? I meant Day to Night if I did. A day to Night Can. And he has the, um, you can see, you know, where some of the nighttime is showing through. Uh, let's open up his and see what it looks like. This, I used to love these Kins because they were so detailed. Look, I mean, look at this vest. I love it. I mean, they don't make them like this anymore, that's for sure. Uh, the little bow tie and, and the shirt with some uh, texture to it. So, very cool. But yeah, that's the day to night Ken. We'll put in with Crystal Can. And then we get to Dream Glow Can. Just uh, three more in this countdown of ten cans. So, um, Dream Glow, I thought this was an excellent suit again. I just, these suits, I just love them, you know. Now, I don't absolutely love his vest, but it, I assume, glows. I'm not positive. Some of you probably know. Uh, but when you cover that part up, it looks very nice. I, I'm not a fan of the part underneath on that one. Um, nice and solid. Very, it feels very nice. The fabric, I'm not sure what fabric this is, but it's almost like velvet. So, very nice. I like this hair color on Can. It's kind of nice and middle of the road. So, that's Dream Glow Can. And then we get to, and I'm 99% sure this is Totally Hair Can, I believe, because look at all the hair. So Totally Hair Can, which I think was from 87, a box date. And I've got him in this Fashion Avenue outfit, because I didn't really like his outfit, and I don't have it. I never had one in the box. Okay, so the last one for today is this guy. This is Rocker Can from the Rocker series. Um, I can't remember if he was the first series or the second, but anyway, 
He is from uh, that series in general. And I don't know if these glasses, sunglasses came with him, but let's take them off for right now. And so you can see he has quite a bit of hair too. And of course it's not flocked, it's this kind. So I thought this was so cool. I love his outfit. And with that, we're gonna close. And I just want to tell you that I have so many other cans, and I want to show some more another time. But for right now, I hope you've enjoyed this quick sweep through 10 cans. Okay, everybody, take care. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.